Baker Baker in the 10B finishing third on the podium. Rob Galler from San Jose fourth. And the 119 of Rick Henderson rounding out that top five. That's going to do it for heat race number three. Out on the track next will be heat race number four. Outside row number four, also from Chilla, California. Driver of the 18, Megan Mayers. Inside of Mayers, it's the 35 of Jay Wood, Johnny Wood. Outside row number three from Wasco, California. It's the 91 of Marcus Wonkum. Inside of Wonkum, it's the 26S. New driver, first time in 2019, Chad Johnson. Outside row number two from Bakersfield, the 99B of Flying, Brian Childress. Inside of Brian Childress, driver of the 8K, Dale Fry. Outside row number one, from also from Bakersfield, California, driver of the number zero, Justin Gonzalez. And on the point for heat race number four for your h and Body Works Hobby Stocks, it is the need for speed, Donnie Mead. Donnie Mead was in the points chase all of 2019 in that number 99 machine. Fell just short of the 10B of Trevor Baker. But that is one to watch right there. This is another fast heat race. Keep an eye on that 26S of Chad Johnson inside row number three, driving his son's car. That's a, been a fast car all year in 2019. It has that 26S of Steven Johnson. Normally drives that car, but now Chad Johnson is going to be driving it for the 34th running of the Budweiser Nationals. Lights are out. Nice tight formation through, down the back straight away. They go. It is Donnie Mead and Justin Gonzalez. Your row number one, row number two, Dale Fry and Flying Brian Childress. Row number three, Chad Johnson and Marcus Wonkum. Johnny Wood and Megan Myers round out the field. Nice, tight formation, slow pace coming off of turn number four. Green flags in the air. We're underway once again. Donnie Mead gets a good jump as he leads him down in turns one and two. The need for speed, Donnie Mead through the middle. Justin Gonzalez getting a good run off of the high side. Jumps the cushion just a bit off of turn number two. They almost get together down the back straight away. But it's going to be Donnie Mead on the point. Gets a little bit of push in the center of one and two. Here comes that 26S of Chad Johnson. Now trying to make a move on Justin Gonzalez. Lap number one goes to the need for speed, Donnie Mead. Here comes that 26S of Chad Johnson. Justin Gonzalez getting all kinds of loose turns one and two. No harm, no foul there, but keep him going. This time coming off of turn number four. We got a good battle on our hands now side by side for that number two spot. Action all over the track. Here comes Matt Wonkum now on the bottom side of Dale Fry. They're running for that third and fourth position, that fourth and fifth position. Here comes that 26S of Chad Johnson. Slide job city gets it done off of turn number four. We got a new leader on our hands. It's Chad Johnson. Then the 99 of the need for speed. Donnie Mead getting all kinds of pressure from Jay Wood, Johnny Wood. Johnny Wood on the bottom side. Donnie Mead on the high side as they go down the back straightaway. Matt Wonkum getting through that race for the fourth position between Justin Gonzalez and Dale Fry. Dale Fry getting it wrong in turns three and four. Sideways they go flying. Brian Childress hard on the binders. Able to keep him from hitting. And he gets that thing spun back around. No caution is out. No caution. No caution. So that was a turn of events. Now we're coming just over halfway th halfway through this one. Five laps down, three laps remaining. It's the 26S of Chad Johnson out in front. Now we got a good battle on our hands. The best battle on the track is for that second position be between Don Mead and Jay Wood, Johnny Wood. Dale Fry slow again down the front straightaway. So your leader getting into traffic. Oh, they're side by side at the stripe for the second position. Johnny Wood trying to put a move on the 99 of Donnie Mead. Down the back straight away they go. Mead up on the high side. Wood down on the bottom. You can see the brace glowing on the 35 as he tries to get the thing woed up on the bottom side. White flag in the air one more time around. Chad Johnson has a straightaway over that lead, over that second place battle between Johnny Wood and the need for speed, Donnie Mead. They're side by side down the back straightaway. Your winner is going to be the 26S of Chad Johnson. But here comes that battle off of turn number four. Give it to the 99 of Donnie Mead. Donnie Mead over Jay Wood. Johnny Wood in the 35. Coming home fourth will be Matt Wonka in the 99. And you'll pick up Justin Gonzalez and flying Brian Childress. And rounding out the field is going to be Megan Myers and the 8K of Dale Fry. So what a good battle between Johnny Wood and the need for speed Donnie Mead for that second and third positions. But taking the win is going to be the 26S of Chad Johnson.
What an exciting, exciting run for your H&S Body Works Hobby Stocks. Next out on the track will be our Slingin' Dirt Mod Lights. 21 of these buzzers, if you will, out on the track. These are very, very, they are small in stature, but they pack a very big punch. These are very fast cars. Don't let the size fool you. You've got some big-time heavy hitters in heat race number one. In row number four, all by himself, driver the 78, Roy Maynard Jr. Outside row number three, the 24C of Kenny Cochran. Inside row number three, the 17 of Tim Varney. Outside row number two from Mesa, Arizona, the 52 of Brent Priest. Inside of Priest from Bakersfield, driver the 68, Caden McCaslin. And outside row number one, from Bakersfield, California, Kobe Lewis. Kobe Lewis in the 48 and on the point. It is the 14 of Hollywood, J.D. Brown. So J.D. Brown and Kobe Lewis. Your front row, Caden McCaslin and Brent Priest. Row number two. Tim Varney, Kenny Cochran, and Roy Maynard Jr. That rounds out the field. Hollywood, J.D. Brown, that young man has come so close in 2019. I believe J.D. Brown did pick up a victory in 2019, so he does have one A main event victory. Does the 14 of Hollywood, J.D. Brown, that is a very young man, I believe 14, 15 years old. Is J.D. Brown on the point? Lights are out. We'll get the green flag this time off of turn number four. J.D. Brown and Colby Lewis side by side at the cone. Green flags in the air. We're underway with heat race number one for the Sling and Dirt Mod Lights. Good jump from the 14 of Hollywood. J.D. Brown, Tim Varney now in the number two spot. Here comes that number 52 machine from Mesa, Arizona. Brendan Priest from Mesa, Arizona up on the high side hustle. Getting it done. Taking over that number two spot. Now we got a good battle on our hands. We got... Hollywood, J.D. Brown down on the bottom side. We've got Priest in the outside. As they go into turns three and four, Hollywood, J.D. Brown jumps up to the cushion, blocks the, blocks the preferred line. He's going to come around and lead lap number two. So it's J.D. Brown, Brendan Priest, one and two in the number three spot. Tim Varney, good battle between Colby Lewis and Roy Maynard Jr. for that number four spot. Kenny Cochran and rounding out the field is going to be that 68 of Caden McCaslin. Battle for your lead in the turns one and two. Down on the bottom side goes Brendan Priest. Brendan Priest trying to make it count. Coming all the way from Arizona to right here in Bakersfield, California. He's going to take the lead on lap number four. We're halfway there. Four laps down. Four laps remaining. Eight laps the distance for this mod light heat race number one. Now we got a battle on our hands for that number three spot. It's Roy Maynard Jr. looking on the bottom side of Tim Varney as they go into turns three and four. J.D. Brown says, I'm not done yet. He's coming back now on the high side. He's trying to make a move back again on that 52 of Brandon Priest. Big time move down the back straight. Away. They're side by side going to turns three and four. Side by side they go. Brandon Priest jumps the cushion just a little bit down on the bottom side. Hollywood, J.D. Brown, they're side by side at the stripe. We're six laps down, two laps remaining. Here comes J.D. Brown. He's on the high side hustle. Down on the gutter is the 52 of Brandon Priest. They're side by side going to three. J.D. Brown trying to get the RPM route, RPM run off of turn number four. Coming to the white flag. White flag. One more lap to go. It's Brendan Priest and J.D. Brown side by side for that number one spot. Once again, they're door to door going into turn number three. Coming off of turn number four. Checkered flag in the air. Give it to the number 14 of Hollywood, J.D. Brown. What a run from that young man. Brendan Priest in the number two spot. Roy Maynard Jr. finishing third, rounding out the... Top four is going to be Tim Varney in the 17. Ladies and gentlemen, give it up for that 14 of Hollywood, J.D. Brown. Doing a fantastic run. Getting back by Brendan Priest from Mesa, Arizona. Picking up heat race number one for the Slinging Dirt Mod Lights. What an exciting finish as Brendan Priest put a move on Hollywood, J.D. Brown, but J.D. Brown was able to get back by and pick up heat race win number one. For heat number two, your lineup will look like this in row number four from Mesa, Arizona. Driver of the 95, Colin Bender. Outside row number three, the 23K, 
the 2019 track champion, the 23K of Caden Cochran. Inside of Cochran from Moore Park, California, driver of the 29, Philip Barrow. Outside row number two, he's the godfather of model lights, driver of the 11, Zach Forrester. Inside of Forrester, he's also from Bakersfield. Driver of the 12, Jeff Thompson. Outside row number two, Jacob the Duke Carey. And on the point from Phoenix, Arizona, driver of the 88, Mike Fay. So Mike Fay from Phoenix, Arizona, inside row number one on the point. But ladies and gentlemen, keep your eyes on the Zach on the attack forester outside row number two and that Cal Prime Joker pack chassis number 11. He is one to watch in the Mod Light division. Picked up three wins early in 2019, took a break. And Caden Cochran, right behind him, took his lead and finished with at least three, I think four A main event victories in that 23K machine and the 2019 track championship. So keep your eyes on that 11 of Zach Forster and the 23K of Caden Cochran as the lights are out. We're coming to the green flag this time off of turn four. They're side by side at the cone. They're picking up the loud pedal and we go green. And it turns one and two they go. It's gonna be the 88 of Mike Faye from Arizona. Oh, gets a little bit loose off of turn number one and two. Giving the lead to the 12 of Jeff Thompson. Jacob the Duke carry up on the high side. Jeff Thompson down on the bottom. Oh, we got one around in turns three and four. We're going to log a lap in the books. Jeff Thompson leads lap number one. And caution will not come out. The caution will not come out. So Mike Fay was able to get that thing refired and going. But here comes that 11 machine of the Zach Forrester. Zach Forrester, your new leader on lap number two. Two laps down, six laps remaining. Here comes Caden Cochran now trying to make a move on Jeff Thompson for that number two spot. Phillip Barrows in the number four spot. So right in front of your leader, we've got action already. So Zach Forrester going, now going to the high side. It turns one and two. Jeff Thompson in that number two spot is going to have that 88 in his line. So he's going to have to get around him on the outside. That's going to allow Caden Cochran now up on the cushion off of turn number four. We got a battle for the number two spot. Now give it to the 23K of Caden Cochran. Zach Forrester, Caden Cochran now getting pressure once again from Jeff Thompson down off the bottom side, but he can't get the drive off of two. Caden Cochran is going to take over that number two spot. Jeff Thompson is going to be third. Fourth is going to be that 29 of Philip Barrows. Fifth will be the 95 of Colin Bender from Mesa, Arizona. Five laps down, three laps remaining. As you can see, the lead that the godfather of Model Light, Zach Forrester, has got over the 23K of Caden Cochran almost a straightaway as they go into turns number one. Caden Cochran now on the bottom side of turns one and two brings Thompson with him. Borrows in the fourth position trying to make up any ground he can. Now he's up on the high side of turns three and four. White flag in the air. One more time around for Zach Forrester. Zach Forster's up on the high side. Caden Cochran down on the bottom side. Down the back straightaway they go into turns number three. Off of turn number four. The checker flag is in the air. Give heat race number two to Zach Forster. Caden Cochran in the number two spot. Then you'll pick up the 12 of Jeff Thompson. Philip Barrows fourth rounding out that top five. Will be the 95 of Colin Bender. Give it up for Zach Forster. Winner of heat race number two in the Sling and Dirt Mod Lights. Next out on the track will be our third and final heat race for the Sling and Dirt Mod Lights in row number four from Bakersfield, California. Driver of the number four, Anthony Balcazar. Outside row number two, also from Bakersfield. Driver of the 71, Candy Varney. Inside of Varney from Phoenix, Arizona. The 114 of Sean Conyers. Outside row number two, this from Chandler, Arizona. The 97 of Steve Bender. Inside of Bender from Henderson, Nevada. The 40X of Derek Rossi. Outside row number one from Bakersfield. The one of Kaylee Forrester. Kylie Forrester. Kylie Forrester in the one and on the point from Mesa, Arizona. The number 94 of Brandy Myers. Brandy Myers in the 94. That will be your lineup. So we've got Arizona, Arizona, California, Nevada, California. Drivers from all over the Western United States. 
for the Budweiser Nationals. Brandy Myers and Ka 